We all dream of having the perfect looking teeth you can see on the red carpet and all over magazine covers. However, not all of us can afford to go to the dentist to have our teeth professionally whitened. And that's okay. Save your hard-earned cash because we've collected 10 effective ways to naturally whiten your teeth without destroying your enamel or your bank account. Before we get into the home remedies, you should know that all of these methods must not be used at the same time. Pick one and stick to it. Plus, if you have problems with your teeth, at-home whitening may not be for you. You can always check with your dentist beforehand to make sure. Taking proper care of your teeth every day is crucial for these remedies to work. So be sure to check out this video to see what common mistakes you might be making in your daily oral care routine. It's definitely eye-opening and useful. And now, let's dive into these DIY remedies for natural teeth whitening in the comfort of your own home. Number 10. Activated Charcoal Activated charcoal has recently been gaining fame as an amazing home remedy for teeth whitening. And it's no surprise, since it's for sure one of the easiest and most inexpensive products to naturally whiten your teeth. As an antioxidant, this stuff truly works wonders by removing all the toxins and surface stains left by tea, coffee, and food consumption. Brushing your teeth with activated charcoal has been proven to lighten them by up to three shades. Pretty impressive, right? So if you want to try it, here's what you should do. Crush up one charcoal tablet into a powder. Dip your clean, wet toothbrush into it and brush your teeth as you normally do. Just don't freak out when your teeth and mouth instantly become covered in the black stuff. It rinses away to reveal brighter, whiter teeth. Number 9. Powdered Milk and Toothpaste Dairy products, especially milk, significantly improve the health of your teeth. That's because milk contains both calcium and phosphorus, which promote the remineralization of tooth enamel. You can either put more dairy products in your diet or simply use powder milk to brush your teeth. Combine it with your toothpaste for an even better effect. Just put some toothpaste on your toothbrush, add a bit of powdered milk on top and brush your teeth. Do this one to two times a week to get your teeth pearly white and strong. Number 8. Baking Soda and Lemon Juice Baking soda does a great job at removing surface stains from your teeth, making them way whiter as a result. Lemon contains vitamin C, which is known for lightening teeth. Not to mention, lemons have antibacterial properties that kill the microorganisms living in your mouth. Hey, nobody invited them in there! The right way to combine these two ingredients would be to put a pinch of baking soda on your toothbrush and then add a few drops of lemon juice over it to achieve a set of bright, shiny teeth. Just don't use this whitening method more than once a week. That's enough to get the desired effect and keep your enamel healthy at the same time. You can also mix one teaspoon of baking soda with two teaspoons of water and brush your teeth with the paste. This combination provides a more gentle cleansing, so you can repeat this procedure a little more frequently, twice a week. Number 7. Hydrogen Peroxide Hydrogen peroxide is basically a bleaching agent, so it's a must-have for teeth whitening. However, before using hydrogen peroxide, make sure that your teeth aren't too sensitive. If you're good to go, simply dip a cotton swab into the peroxide and gently rub it on your teeth. Be careful though, because this whitening technique isn't recommended for frequent use as it can harm your enamel. Doing it once or twice a week would be plenty. If you don't want to risk damaging your teeth, you can always find a toothpaste with hydrogen peroxide in it from the store. This way you don't have to worry about your teeth sensitivity because the hydrogen peroxide is balanced out with other ingredients. Hydrogen peroxide can also be used as a mouthwash before brushing your teeth. Just make sure that you're using either a 1.5% or 3% solution for this. Other possible options are hydrogen peroxide gel or even teeth whitening strips. So get your hands on some hydrogen peroxide in any of its forms and enjoy your new snow white teeth. Number 6. Baking powder and lemon juice 
Baking powder eliminates stains on the surface of your teeth, and lemon juice, as we already said, has multiple components that lighten teeth. Just mix a teaspoon of baking powder and a teaspoon of freshly squeezed lemon juice, and you guessed it, you brush your teeth with the paste. This mixture will work wonders in just two minutes. But remember the golden rule, do not leave it on your teeth for more than two minutes because it'll damage your enamel. After a couple of weeks of using this home treatment once or twice a week, your teeth will be so blinding that you'll have to warn people to put on some sunglasses before you smile at them. Number five, sea salt, lemon juice, and toothpaste. Another great component for a homemade teeth whitening remedy is sea salt. It has loads of important minerals and elements such as calcium, magnesium, and iron, among others. Sea salt has antibacterial properties as well, which freshen your breath and protect your enamel. So if you want to see these amazing effects for yourself, mix half a teaspoon of sea salt and some freshly squeezed lemon juice with a small amount of toothpaste in a bowl. Apply the mixture to your teeth and leave it on for a minute before rinsing your mouth thoroughly. Just like with most of the procedures on this list, repeat one to two times a week. Number four, lemon juice and water. A mixture of equal parts lemon juice and water will help restore whiteness to your teeth and completely disinfect your oral cavity. To test this out, mix one teaspoon of water with one teaspoon of freshly squeezed lemon juice. Brush your teeth thoroughly with the combined liquids and then rinse it out. After that, brush your teeth again, this time with your regular toothpaste. Do this just once a week. Another possible method is to apply the water-lemon mixture directly onto your teeth and leave it there like a mask for about 10 minutes. After the time's up, rinse your mouth out with water. You can do this twice a week for better results. Number three, apple cider vinegar and water. Apple cider vinegar is a highly powerful cleansing and disinfecting agent. It removes stains and kills all the bacteria in your mouth. Simply dilute half a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar in a glass of water and use this homemade mouthwash every morning before brushing your teeth. Don't worry, the water balances out the acidity of the vinegar, so it's totally fine to use this mixture daily. Another equally effective method is to simply rub apple cider vinegar directly onto your teeth. Leave it for about five minutes and then rinse your mouth with water. However, you can do this more concentrated version only once a week, of course, because the vinegar can break down the tooth enamel, so be careful. Number two, a strawberry. Pretty much everybody knows that strawberries are super delicious and healthy. But did you know that they're great for lightening your teeth as well? That's because they're acidic, which, if you haven't noticed by now, is great for teeth whitening. The easiest way to make use of it is to take a ripe strawberry and mash it up with a spoon. Brush your teeth with this paste for a few minutes to get rid of yellow stains. You can do this once a month. Hey, while you're at it, why not throw in some baking soda to the mix? In this case, you should mash up one strawberry, add half a teaspoon of baking soda, stir them together, dip your toothbrush into the mixture, and brush your teeth with it. Don't forget to leave the mixture on your teeth for about five minutes, and then rinse your mouth with water. Repeat this one to two times a week. Number one, toothpaste, sea salt, baking soda, and lemon juice. It's great to use these powerful remedies one by one, but why not combine them all and make one super remedy? Super remedy to the rescue. Plus, notice that while we warned you earlier not to combine all the remedies, with this specific combination, you'll be okay, if you're careful, because it has a safe enough balance of acidic and alkaline components. So here's what you should do. Mix one tablespoon of toothpaste, a pinch of sea salt, a bit of baking soda, and four to five drops of lemon juice in a bowl. Brush your teeth with this mixture for four to five minutes. You'll see the difference in just one use. But don't get too excited. That immediate result is due to the fact that this treatment is potent with a capital P. You can use this method only once every two months. The effect will last quite a long time, so don't overdo it and hurt your poor enamel. 
And there you have it. Achieving the perfect smile is way easier than you'd think. Many people believe that a white teeth smile is something a person is born with. Either you have it or you don't. Luckily, that's not the case. Particular toothbrushing techniques can help you make your smile brighter and whiter. 8. Choose the right toothbrush Modern toothbrushes don't just help you keep your teeth clean. Nowadays, you can opt for a special toothbrush to remove plaque from your teeth, massage your gums, and even whiten your teeth. If your goal is to make your smile shine brightly, choose a toothbrush with rubber inserts. Such devices were created with the very purpose of making your teeth whiter because the rubber inserts polish your teeth really well. Soft bristled toothbrushes are also great for polishing teeth. They clean your teeth more effectively because the bristles buff away surface stains. 7. Pick the right toothpaste you can find a whitening toothpaste in most stores these days. Despite what many people think, such toothpastes normally don't contain any bleach to change the color of your teeth. A whitening toothpaste makes your smile whiter with the help of abrasive chemicals or particles. Some of these components help polish your teeth, others work by binding to stains and pulling them off the surface stains of your teeth. According to numerous studies, the abrasive particles in whitening toothpaste don't harm teeth. They are no more damaging to the enamel than any other toothpaste. 6. Pay attention to your mouthwash Some types of mouthwash have components that can remove surface stains. One of these components is hydrogen peroxide, a popular bleaching agent. If you use such a mouthwash for a prolonged time, it can help remove stains from your teeth and, therefore, make them whiter. However, you need to be extra careful while choosing this product. Not all kinds of mouthwash are harmless. For example, products containing high amounts of alcohol can dry out your mouth. And a dry mouth is, surprisingly, one of the most common reasons for bad breath. Also, such mouthwashes are dangerous for children and often irritate the tissues in your mouth. Lastly, mouthwashes that contain chlorohexidine aren't good for long-term use as this substance can change the way you taste things. 5. Brush your teeth correctly After you've prepared everything you need to give your teeth a good brush, you can get down to the practical part. Your toothbrush should be positioned at a 45-degree angle to your gums. Brush your teeth by using gentle back-and-forth strokes. Try to concentrate on the spots covered with stains. Brush not only the outer surface of your teeth, but also the inside. To clean the inside of your front teeth, position your toothbrush vertically and brush the surface with several up and down strokes. After brushing your teeth, remember to clean your tongue as well. This way, you'll get rid of bacteria buildup and, consequently, eliminate the main cause of bad breath. 4. Remember to replace your toothbrush. According to the American Dental Association, you should throw away your toothbrush every two to four months. Only in this way will you be able to keep your teeth healthy. A frayed and worn down toothbrush won't do your teeth any good. It will be unable to polish your teeth correctly or remove surface stains. On top of that, by using it, you'll constantly be transferring bacteria back to your mouth. If you dream about a white smile, get rid of your toothbrush as soon as you notice that its bristles have become frayed. And it doesn't matter if it isn't two months old yet. 3. Follow a white teeth diet Firm and crisp foods can make your teeth whiter and cleaner. Here are several products that will help you reach your goal. Strawberries. These berries are rich in malic acids. These acids assist in converting carbohydrates into the energy your muscles use. In addition, they can effectively dissolve superficial teeth stains. Cauliflower Vegetables such as broccoli and cauliflower can make your teeth whiter if you crunch these products raw. It's not easy to chew these veggies. That's why when you do this, your mouth produces a lot of saliva. Saliva, along with hard vegetable pieces, breaks down staining. Nuts and Seeds Nuts and seeds act as amazing exfoliants. When you munch on almonds, walnuts, or sunflower seeds, their abrasive texture strips surface stains from the enamel of your teeth. Thus, you protect your teeth from discoloration and whiten their surface. 
pineapple. Bromelain, which is found in pineapples, is an enzyme that reduces inflammation. It's also great for the health of your teeth as it disrupts the proteins covering the enamel. By doing this, bromelain removes stains and discoloration. After the products get disrupted, stains can be easily washed away with your saliva. Yogurt and cheeses Dairy products make your mouth produce more saliva, which breaks down enamel stains. Plus, cheese has a whitening effect thanks to the lactic acid it contains. This acid, just like malic acid, clears away surface stains from your teeth. Celery Having an incredibly high water content, celery washes away pieces of food stuck between your teeth and makes your gums stronger. Besides, celery has a rigid structure which works as a scrub. As a result, when you chew raw celery, it physically removes stains from tooth enamel. Onions Surely onions aren't too great for your breath? But at the same time, this vegetable contains particular sulfur compounds that don't let plaque appear on your teeth. For reaping all the benefits of this method, you need to crunch raw onions. 2. Know your enemies There are products that can leave stains on your teeth or make the color of the teeth darker. Among such foods are blueberries, beets, popsicles, tomato juice, soy sauce, and balsamic vinegar. Some drinks also prevent you from getting a white smile. Your teeth have tiny pores that absorb all the liquids you drink. Therefore, all dark liquids have the potential to stain your teeth. That's why if you're used to brushing your teeth in the morning and drinking a cup of coffee right after that, you better forget about this habit. But if you can't function without some coffee in the morning, at least dilute this drink with some milk to prevent serious staining. Another drink that may make your teeth darker is black tea. Some people replace coffee with tea to avoid staining. They probably don't know that tea is rich in tannins, which can stain your teeth as easily as coffee. If you absolutely must drink tea, opt for white or green teas. Even though they may still leave marks on your teeth, these stains won't be as dark as after black tea. Other drinks you should avoid to keep your teeth white are sodas, red wine, and dark juices. If you can't live without sodas, try to buy those with light colors. But even while they won't stain your teeth, the acid and artificial sugar they contain will still damage your enamel. And last but not least, if you smoke, consider getting rid of this habit. No smoker can have a white smile. Even if you aren't a chain smoker, cigarettes can still cause tooth discoloration when the color of your teeth becomes gray or yellow. Besides, smoking leads to serious tooth damage such as tooth decay, periodontal disease, and even tooth loss. 1. Maintain your teeth daily Finally, if you want to see a beautiful white smile every time you look in the mirror, you need to care for your teeth regularly. According to Dr. Kathleen W. Wilson, you should brush your teeth twice a day, right after you get out of bed and before you go to sleep at night. In the morning, you clean off the bacteria and plaque that has accumulated during the night because the saliva that protects your mouth dries up when you sleep. This is also why you need to remove all pieces of food and clean your mouth before going to bed. Also, remember to floss your teeth every time you feel the need.